hello guys assalamu alaikum and welcome to my channel my name is Osama and in today's video I am going to guide you about the complete application process of another university of Italy that is University of Casino so first we will talk about the university and then I will guide you about the complete application process so University of Casino is a public university of Italy and it was built in 1979 if we talk about the ranking, so uh, according to QS World University Ranking 2024, it has been ranked at the position of 1251. And if we talk about the acceptance rate, so it is around 70%. So it has a really good acceptance rate. So you all should apply into this university. If we talk about the required CGPA, so it is around 25 but some programs have a uh, different requirement so we will check the requirements of these programs and for bachelors mostly programs requires 70% uh, marks in your uh, 12th grade or in your uh, higher secondary education or FSC uh, so for bachelors the requirement of marks is 70% and for those who wants to apply in masters program the requirement is uh, a CGPA of 2.5 and if you talk about the deadline so the deadline for first round of applications is 30th April 2024 for the year 2024 to 2025 now we will uh, start our application process and for that we will come on to the uh, official website of the university so here you can see the option international you will have to click on that option after clicking on that option here you can see uh, international bachelors masters and phd program so we'll click on that option here uh, they have given us um, the options of bachelors masters uh, dual and joint degrees phd program so uh, if you want to apply into the bachelor's degree so we'll click on the bachelor's degree after clicking on the bachelor's degree here they have shown uh, us the list of the programs that are available for international students and that are taught in english so we have three programs in bachelor's and we have uh, um, around five programs in masters so if you want to apply into masters program you can apply in any of these program and if you want to apply in bachelors program you can choose from any of these programs so uh, if we talk about the requirements for admissions into this program so for that you will have to click on the program for example if i want to apply in bachelor's degree in economics and business so i'll click on the economics and business option and then here you can see a uh, bachelor description then here you can see academic staff so for uh, checking out requirements we'll click on pre-admission button uh, after clicking on pre-admission button you will have uh, two options uh, by clicking on the enrollment button uh, you will uh, uh, be uh, taken to the page from where you will apply and for requirements we'll click on the admission requirement button so here you can see they have written uh, all of the requirements for uh, admission into bachelor's program for, uh, overall high school grade point average so minimum 70% marks are required in your high school and uh, your high school diploma or bachelor's degree must not be older than five years so if your degree is older than five years be it uh, a bachelor's degree or a high school uh, diploma if you are applying for bachelors only this requirements is for bachelors over here since we are checking out the requirements for bachelor's degree so if your high school degree is five year uh, is older than five years uh, so you cannot apply uh, into these programs but if your degree is not older than five years then you can apply into any of the bachelor's program uh, uh, and here you can see uh, the uh, other requirements for example if uh, only uh, those students who were born between 1999 and 2006 can apply for a bachelor's program in this university so that is another uh, criteria so the age uh, they have set an age limit and they've also uh, written uh, about the English certificate. So uh, the requirement for English is uh, for this program is a TOEFL 
and then Duolingo is 100 and for IELTS you should have minimum of 5.5 bands but you can also apply with uh, your uh, medium of instruction certificate that is English proficiency certificate but it's preferred that you should have any of these uh, certificates so this is the requirement for bachelor's degree now if you want to apply in any of the bachelor's program so you can apply by clicking on the uh, option that you want to apply for for example i want to apply for uh, industrial engineering so i will click on that option and then i will uh, click on the course website from here after clicking on the course website here you will choose how to apply button so after clicking on the how to apply button you will be taken to the uh, page from where you will apply so here, here they've given us the requirements and here we have a button of apply now so we'll click on the apply now button after clicking on the apply now button they will take you to the screen and through this screen you will apply so uh, the this screen will appear for masters and bachelors uh, programs and through this screen you will apply for example uh, if i want to apply in any of the masters program so for that i will come on to the uh, home page again and then from there i will choose any of the masters program for example i'm choosing economics and entrepreneurship here you can uh, check out the requirements so for, uh, for checking out the requirement you can click on this course website button after clicking on the course website button here you can click you will click on the pre-admission button and here you will check the admission requirements so for a master's program uh, you should have uh, if you are from india or pakistan you should have at least 60 percent marks in uh, economics or statistics because uh, the master's program that i clicked uh, i selected it was related to economics and statistics so uh, if you have a degree in economics or statistics or mathematics you should have at least 60 percent marks so that's uh, not uh, quite a big requirement and if you have done in uh, bachelor's in any of these programs the requirement for uh, percentage is 70 percent in your bachelor's degree so uh, the requirements varies from country to country for example if you are from uh, ethiopia then uh, the requirements for your degree is at least b marks uh, in uh, economics and mathematics and b plus in uh, the following subjects that are given in this list uh, and if we talk about other countries so you can read out the requirements for other countries as well so these are the requirements for economics and entrepreneurship programs similarly you can check out the requirements for other uh, master's um, degree programs so if we want to apply into this program so we will click on the pre-enrollment after clicking on the pre-enrollment here you can see uh, process so first we will have uh, to apply for pre-admission so for that we will register ourselves on this on this screen uh, and the documents that are required are a cv and identity document for example a passport and then uh, you also require a motivation letter and you will require a university transcript uh, or a provisional certificate with a transcript of five semesters if you are uh, going to graduate in uh, 2023 to 2024 so uh, if you are still in your eighth semester then you can submit your provisional certificate and transcript of uh, the uh, uh, the semesters that are completed and if you have uh, uh, your degree already then you can uh, apply with your official transcript and degree and uh, here they've also uh, asked about the english uh, knowledge certificate so we can upload our uh, english proficiency certificate the last line means that the english proficiency certificate that you get from your university is also acceptable so you can apply with your english proficiency certificate you don't need any IELTS for master's program so uh, in bachelor's you might need IELTS, uh, Duolingo or TOEFL but in uh, for master's program you don't need any uh, IELTS but if you have IELTS it's uh, a plus point if you don't have IELTS you can still apply now if you want to apply for a master's program so we'll apply from here 
here they have given us a link so the deadline for master's program is 30 april 2024 so uh, uh, for uh, applying onto the program we'll click on the link that they have given us here after clicking on that link it will take you to the same page that you saw in the uh, bachelor's application process so the application process for masters and bachelors is same so uh, for example if i want to apply in masters program so i've uh, um, uh, come on to this page so first of all i will uh, register myself so for that i will uh, click on the new account button And then here I will uh, fill all of this information. So first of all, I'll write my first name. Then I'll write my last name. Then here I will choose my gender, male or female. If you are male, choose M. If you are female, choose F. And then you will choose your uh, date of birth. After choosing your date of birth, you will choose the country you were born in. So uh, the country of birth. So my country of birth is Pakistan, for example. So I will write Pakistan. Then you will uh, write about your nationality. Then you will uh, write about your uh, university that issued your bachelor uh, degree. So if you are applying for masters, you will write your uh, university's name after writing your university's name you were write the subject of your um, bachelor's degree for example uh, if uh, my subject is economics so i will write economics and then here you will choose uh, ielts or toefl so if you have taken ielts you will choose yes if you haven't taken your ielts or toefl you will choose no uh, then here you will write bachelor's degree class or division so uh, if you have a degree that is uh, that is that has division or classes then you will choose first second or third uh, option or other option and if uh, your degree uh, doesn't have the uh, class or divisions uh, um, classification then you will choose not applicable and then here you can choose bachelor's degree in percentage so uh, here you will choose your percentage so if you have a 90 percent uh, 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 so if you have a cgp of 90 percent here you will choose the 90 option if you have a cgp of 80 percent you can choose 80 option and uh, this is how you will fill this uh, cgp option because it is in percentage then here you will write your uh, residential address and then here you will write your email address after writing your email address here you will here you will check the privacy option and then here you will insert the captcha code and after filling all of this information here you will click on the create account option so my account has been created successfully and they have sent an email on to my email address so i'll check my inbox you can see i have received uh, my password my code and username so I will copy my uh, password from here and then here they have given me the link for login so I will click on that uh, link to login and here I will paste my password so here I can see all of my information that I have filled in my uh, registration process and I will click on the submit application button after clicking on the submit application button here they have asked us to upload my documents so uh, first i'll upload my motivation letter then i'll upload my cv and then i will upload my english language certificate and then i will upload my university transcript so here uh, they have uh, given us a section for that so here you will uh, click on the uh, drag down menu and from here you will choose the document that you want to upload so for example i'm uploading my university transcripts first so i will choose the university transcripts option and then i will choose on uh, click on the choose file option and from uh, there i will uh, select and choose my uh, uh, transcripts and after that i will click on the submit file button
but uh, you should make sure that your uh, documents are in pdf format if your documents are not in pdf form then it won't be uploaded on this portal so uh, after uploading all of my documents over here here i can delete my document if i have mistakenly uploaded any uh, wrong document so uh, by clicking on the cross button i can uh, remove uh, the document and re-upload it from this section and after that uh, here you can see we have an option of choose the program so we will choose uh, both of the programs that are given over here and after choosing both of the programs uh, they've also asked us about our priority so we will choose the program that is preferred by us so among these two so for example i prefer a uh, global economy and business among these two programs so i will choose this because i prefer this uh, program among these two more uh, after that here you can see the payment option so uh, uh, the application fee for this uh, university is uh, only 10 euro so for that you will click on the pay now button after clicking on the pay now button here you can see uh, the payment option uh, if you want to uh, pay through uh, your uh, card that is visa card mastercard or union pay or any of these cards given below or uh, if you want to pay through google pay or this another option that is given over here so uh, you can choose the desired option from here if you, i want to pay through my card so i will choose use payment method so uh, after clicking on the uh, card method here i will enter all of the details about my card and after that i will click on the next option and uh, my uh, fee will be submitted and after uh, submitting your fee here uh, you will see the uh, submit option uh, in your uh, portal so you will click on the submit option and your uh, application will be submitted so this was an easy process of the uh, application for uh, the university of casino uh, you also must apply into this university because it has a good acceptance rate and it is a public university so after getting admission into this university you can also get a regional scholarship so uh, this was the complete process uh, thank you so much for watching my video uh, please like my video comment and subscribe my channel for more amazing videos and you can also ask any questions if you have any confusion and you can also uh, uh, demand any video will uh, try to uh, fulfill your demands thank you for watching my video Allah Hafiz